UWP leader Alan Shastny says the year 2015 was a very good one for the United Workers' Party and looking back at what he described as the party's achievements, added that the party was able to stand its ground concerning a number of issues plaguing the country, like the high gas prices earlier in the year, measures to stem the tide of unemployment, the cost of electricity, the Lambert's Academy scandal and the Citizenship by Investment program. But the biggest of them all, as far as Mr. Chastney is concerned, is the impacts report. Chastney says it's been two weeks since the EU statement calling on the government to follow due process in the matter came out. And so far, nothing has been done. And at the same time, he has now uh, damaged the name of St. Lucia internationally. We've seen a letter from the EU, um, one in which the, up to now, two weeks later, the government hasn't even given a response to, um, tells me that this government has lost the moral authority governing this country. I believe that they have lost the confidence and the trust of the people of St. Lucia. And the United Workers' Party intends to bring more of these things and put more pressure on the government um, in the year ahead. Mr. Chastney spoke about the internal wrangling within his own party. The party has undergone a shake-up in recent times, one member being expelled and several others removed from the positions they once occupied. Chastney believes that the recent shake-up will inspire public confidence. He says he will not wait for the public or the opposition to bring to light any act of misconduct within the party. He stated that the party will take the initiative to correct the matter and that in itself, according to him, will serve to reinforce the party's commitment to high moral values. We're looking for men and women who share those things and are committed to those same causes. Um, it is not about any of our own individual interest. It's not about um, our own personal standing. It's about whether this party can bring uh, development um, and relief of poverty to um, the, the country. And that is what we're focused on. And so we are only looking to work with people who share those same values. So any changes that have taken in, in place in the party is, is a, a recommitment to those values. And I, I want people of St. Lucia, the citizens of St. Lucia, the voters of St. Lucia to have confidence in the United Workers Party that we are not going to be deterred. Shasni vowed to apply more pressure on the government in the coming year. For the DBS News World, I'm Don Nicholas.